You guys missed us? Our one viewer out yeah. there. Yeah, those three people out there. Did you miss us? We missed us. Well, we're back anyways. Yeah. So we are trying a wine from Argentina today. All right. It's called Los Geraldos. Heraldos. No, you just go with whatever you say. And it's a blend. And I bought this one because it looked so rich it does look rich <laughs> but it was 14.95 fancy it and then it's got fancy. a double sticker which i'm like oh very good double no, sticker that. so there you go that was my rationale that's your rationale yeah it does you know again we're, we're so educated now but if i did see this bottle i would like it's embossed fancy version. It, but it is it looks it looks you know again you, the the cues are there to make you think it's Yes. Much more expensive than it probably is. And yeah. decanter, like again, I'm I'm not a wine geek, but I even know decanter. So the fact they have stickers on here, I even know, I even know what that means. So that's oh. that's you know, now but, it's a silver. I don't know what that part. But it's means. it's World Wine Awards. Like yeah. that's big. decanter is a big name. It's <laughs> and not then like the other ones. James Suckling. James Suckling, yeah, suck it, James <laughs> Suckling, so, James. There you go. That's what it is, and it's a blend. It is a blend. Malbec, Cab Sab, and Petit Verdo. Verdo. 15%. Interesting, and looking at this label, it says they always say contain sulfite. Yeah. And egg. An egg? Which I find that odd. That, well, it wouldn't be what I'd expect. Egg. I guess we got to read up on this part. What do they crack eggs in there? Just like. Or like, what's that drink with the egg whites? Egg whites. <laughs> you know, yeah. A lot of fizzy cocktails have the egg. Well, so let's see what happens when you pour it out. Yeah, right? let's do this. Shall I? You shall. I shall. Oh, it's very purple. Very purple. Hmm. Hmm. It's per like you don't see that very often. Purple. There we go. Ooh. Oh, the sun. There you go, right there. Hmm. Hmm. You're making noises over here. <laughs> hmm. It smells delicious, actually. You can smell like a lot of really dark, dark fruits. Like, mm -hmm. And something super sweet. Vanilla. I was going to say vanilla, yeah. actually. You get a really good, you're right, it's very sweet, but it's not like a red fruit sweet. No, no. And if you smell hard, <laughs> you smell hard, <laughs> smell hard, man. You can smell a bit of like espresso, maybe, or you have to smell hard. Like, you gotta smell hard. <laughs> you gotta get past that first smell and smell hard. Smell deep. <laughs> deep. That's smell what... deep. Smell hard. A bit of coffee. Yeah. Interesting. That is interesting. Delicious. But yeah, really the vanilla, I, mm -hmm. I get it right off the bat there. Cheers. There we go. Cheers. Mm, you don't taste that. <laughs> no. I'm not saying it's bad, but no, no. it's unexpected. Based on what, what the nose gave yeah. you. Yeah. Yeah. There's a hard acidity to it. There is. Like, yeah. I feel like I'm describing curling. It's hard! Hard! <laughs> hard! <laughs> and it's not, um, it tastes, it leaves in that, I get the little bit of tobacco taste. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've never understood when people talk about leathery. Mm -hmm. Right, I'm like leather. Who? Well, I don't know how what, le but I can like from a from a, a mouthfeel standpoint, it's very because of the acid. I think it dries your mouth mm -hmm. out. Like it's kind of yeah, it does. Yeah, yeah, and kind of gives you a little bit of that aftertaste, which I'm not going to call leathery, but it kind of no, because that feel it doesn't sound it doesn't like, sound it sounds yeah, I don't it's not get appealing. It. Like 
cow. Who wants to lick my leather old jacket cow. or something? Yeah, old L cow. Licking your leather jacket? <laughs> yeah, that, that tastes similar, but yeah. It's hard. It, I'm having a hard time just getting past the the initial hit to the mouth, like the acid. It's interesting though when you say dry mouth. Yeah, like super dry. I need water. Yeah, I know water. But I wish I could come up with a little bit more flavor description. But what well, we came up with tobacco, leather. Yeah. It's not fruity at all. Not, mm. I wouldn't say it's sweet at all either. No. Not sure how many grams of sugar in this. Yeah. It doesn't say on the label. Interesting. Interesting. I don't take. I, I, I got to find out about the egg part. The egg is interesting. Egg and wine. I don't. It's got to be something to do with their process. Yeah. Ready? Yeah, yes. man. Let's do it. And it was a cork. We haven't had a cork in a long time. You know, when you get to that. <laughs> like, who cares if I who saw cares? it? Who cares? Yeah. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. One, two, three, five, and a four. I gotta say, I was expecting more with the two stickers. I was expecting, you know, it to be better finished than it was. Yeah, me too. It set me up. It set me up because the bottle's nice, the the freight, the aromas were nice, but the taste just didn't do it for me. I agree. And I guess it might just be us. Like maybe I'm just a fruit fruity kind of guy. <laughs> Duh. Duh. Hey, <laughs> but so I don't know if anyone would like this. Maybe someone who likes more on the acid like dry, the drier one. Yeah. So again, give it a shot. It's fourteen ninety five at the and LCBO. Maybe aerate it. Aerate. I always help. My favorite word. Make it more a little bit yeah. more flavorful. That's you. Good point. Good point. But we agreed a long time ago. We're not going to do that. We're just going to. No, we, we drink it from the bottle. Straight from the bottle, man. Yeah. That's the way. That's the way we roll. <laughs> That's how we roll here. That's what we do. We're not fancy. I got my, my Boats and Hose t-shirt. Prestige <laughs> Worldwide. Boats and Hose. Dog, yeah, so fancy. I know. I figured she'd say uh, something. Like, get changed. I'm like, no way. No way, man. Boats and Hose night. I like it. What's that? I like it. It's a great movie, if you yeah. haven't seen it. <laughs> we should do movie reviews as part of it. You know, instead of, we'll do one o'clock one night and then we'll do our movie review. It would have to be immediately following the movie. For you, yeah. yeah. You'd be like, I'd have to videotape you right away. Yeah. And you could do the romantic comedy stuff and I'll just do, you know. No, I'm liking thrillers. Thrillers, like cops, yeah. Cop shit. Yeah, really. cop shit. Yeah. Cops gone wrong. Cops gone wrong. <laughs> <laughs> you know, those are good movies. Yeah. Those. Yeah. All right. Okay. <laughs> We can talk about... We're just chatting yeah. now. You know, we can let you guys go. All right. We'll see you next time. Bye.